Morning. Um, back live again from the Masamara. Um, brought to you by Make It Kenya. Um, and with us today we actually have one of the key guys that's, that's made this happen with us, Stuart. Um, Stuart Price from Make It Kenya and he's our official photographer and bringing us all the wonderful images that you see. Stuart, thanks a lot for joining us and, and taking some of your time to, to join us on this wonderful journey here in, in the Masamara. Just tell us a, a little bit more about you and, uh, and, and if you're enjoying it out here. Sure, absolutely, thanks. Um, yeah, I'm Stuart Price from Make It Kenya. Uh, we're here with the Herd Track guys, Discover Africa. Uh, second day, we've already seen some amazing things. We had the crossing yesterday morning, yeah. afternoon spent with the Marsh Pride of Lions, made famous by BBC's Big Cat Diary. Uh, wonderful light, changing weather conditions, uh, wind whipping in. It was fantastic to photograph, wonderful imagery. You find that every day here in the Mara. It's, it's, it's just a magical place to come and shoot pictures. This morning we've just seen a balloon launch. Um, quite tricky because we arrived here before daybreak and sunrise. Yeah. So you've got quite quick and rapid changing conditions. The sun yeah. rises very quickly in this part of the world because of our proximity to the equator. Yeah. Um, but uh, you can capture some great images with, uh, with the light, particularly with the f uh, flame coming up as the balloons are taking off. Wow. And no, I think, I think the guys enjoyed it, huh? They were in good spirits in the basket there. Got a little slow there for our viewers. It's coming up. We're actually going backwards, so it's getting darker. Here we go. Just oh, for yeah. the launch. With the flames, the two balloons, and they rose quickly. Once they were up off the ground, they were oh, yeah. up, up, up and away, weren't they? So, Stuart, we're going to hop into a basket in a couple of days from now, and uh, then we'll be experiencing um, what Moses and and Mark from Silas Camp uh, are doing right now. Huh? Yeah, sure. Drifting over the Masamara. I mean, absolutely, and, absolutely. And what a privilege to be able to do that. And again, from a photographic perspective. Uh, a really, really different angle to, to capture the Mara, its inhabitants, all the animals from the air. Lovely conditions, beautiful clear skies, wonderful sunrise. Yeah, really looking forward to it. Hard work, eh? I must say, yeah? but someone's well, got to do it. Eh? Yeah, it's, it, it's up early and uh, of course capturing the images is just half of the process. We then have to edit and then we have to transmit from this part of the world, which can sometimes be a challenge. But, yeah, we'll um, try and uh, get you some more bandwidth this morning. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, and a little bit... Uh, Better conditions than uh, the work you've done in the past. You know, you've been all over. Yes, yes, I've worked uh, across this region from the Sudan to Somalia, Congo, Kenya, Uganda, Tanzania, Rwanda. Um, but uh, to be here working with you guys and, and to be experience the Masai Mara, absolutely fantastic. Um, and we greatly advocate anyone who's thinking of coming on a safari to, to make it Kenya, to come here and uh, experience these things firsthand. It really is a wonderful experience. Perfect. Thank you very much. We're going to sign Thank off you. and go find something to eat. Let's go and see what we can see. Wonderful. Great. Thanks. Cheers. Thanks, guys. Got it. Is it right? Yeah. Yeah, man. You're wonderful, man. You're natural. Perfect.